Here we have our beautiful model Sage who is going to help us recreate Kim Kardashian's beautiful bridal makeup look. So Sage is already based with a Smashbox light primer, painterly paint pot on her eyelids, and for her foundation, we used Urban Decay's Naked Skin, and I mixed the shades in 5.0 and 6.0. And from there, we set her foundation with Urban Decay's Naked Medium Light Powder. And this is from the Naked Skin Ultra Definition line. I'm gonna to go to my trusted go-to bridal palette, which is the brand new Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. From this palette is a perfect blend of mattes and shimmers. So we're gonna take our transition shade, which is the matte number two. And it's just a very warm matte brown. And this is gonna make sure that our crease area is nice and well blended. We're gonna use a M number six shade from the Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. I'm gonna take this with a pointed crease blending brush and blend this and really define Sage's crease. From here, I'm gonna intensify the look with a basic matte black shade. And we're really, really gonna define that crease and this is really the technique that gives Kim her signature look. For the lid area, I decided um, for Sage's skin tone and her eye color, which is a gorgeous like hazel brown, I'm using Urban Decay's Chopper Eyeshadow. And it is like a golden peachy color and it has a lot of shimmer and a lot of reflex with it. I actually chose to use this wet. To intensify Sage's lash line, I'm going to use my Urban Decay 24-7 Eyeliner in Perversion. And no need to be like extra neat with it. I just use short strokes because I'm going to take a matte black eyeshadow and smoke this out at the lash line. Make it really smooth, really crisp. And give a slight wing. And of course for mascara, I use the Urban Decay Cannonball because you always need a fabulous waterproof uh, mascara on the day of your wedding. From here I use my favorite eyelashes which are the Demi Wispy Lashes. They are absolutely perfect for this look. It adds thickness and just a flirty flare with the lashes. And to end everything else, I took a flat shader brush and just defined um, the lower lash line. I also went into her waterline with the Urban Decay Naked Basics um, Dual End eyeliner pencil and I use the shade Venus. For Sage's contour, I reach for my trusty Makeup Forever Compact Shine On. For blush, I use MAC Lovejoy Blush and I use a light fan brush to give a really, really light like application so that it looks like she's blushing and not like there's a whole bunch of blush on her face. I'm using one of my favorite highlighters which is the Physicians Formula Mineral Glow Pearls. And this is in a translucent pearl. It kind of has like a pinky tone to it. Really, really love it. It's like one of my must-haves. And for her lips, I am using the Jordana Lip Liner in Coco. One of my faves. It's $1.50, so how can you say no? It's amazing. I don't have the name of this lip tar that I'm putting on Sage's lips. It's just like a perfect kind of like neutral peachy color and I topped it off with Rimmel London's show off lip lacquer in nude eclipse and after everything is done of course I have to set it with my Urban Decay makeup setting spray in D slick which is the oil control keeps your makeup for hours so here's our Kim K look Hope you enjoy. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe.